Life should be an exciting adventure. It should never be a bore. A man should live fully, be alive. He should be glad to get out of bed in the morning. He should be doing a job he likes to do because he does it well. One time I heard Grove Patterson make a speech, the editor-in-chief of the Toledo Daily Blade. And as he concluded his speech, he said something that I've never forgotten. He said something like this. My years in the newspaper business have convinced me of several things. Among them, that people are basically good. And that we came from someplace, and we're going someplace. So we should make our time here an exciting adventure. The architect of the universe didn't build a stairway leading nowhere. And the greatest teacher of all, the carpenter from the plains of Galilee, gave us the secret time and time again. As ye believe, so shall it be done unto you. On side number one of this record, I've explained the strangest secret in the world and how it works. Now, on this side, I want to explain how you can prove to yourself the enormous returns possible in your own life by putting this secret to a practical test. I want you to make a test that will last 30 days. Now, it isn't going to be easy. If you'll give it a good try, it will completely change your life for the better. Back in the 17th century, Sir Isaac Newton, the English mathematician and natural philosopher, gave us some natural laws of physics which apply as much to human beings as they do to the movement of bodies in the universe. Now, one of these laws is that for every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Simply stated, as it applies to you and me, it means we can achieve nothing without paying the price. The results of your 30-day experiment will be in direct proportion to the effort you put forth. To be a doctor, you must pay the price of long years of difficult study. To be successful in selling, and remember that each of us succeeds to the extent of his ability to sell. Selling our families on our ideas, selling education in schools, selling our children on the advantages of living the good and honest life. Selling our associates and employees on the importance of being exceptional people. To, of course, the profession of selling itself. But to be successful in selling our way to the good life, we must be willing to pay the price. Now, what is that price? Well, it's many things. First, it's understanding emotionally, as well as intellectually, that we literally become what we think about. That we